Hello friends, this is a fresh installed WordPress site and the domain name is dev5.dev In this video, we are going to see how we can use external email hosting with a WordPress site So, uh, for this domain, I am using Cloudflare to manage DNS and you can see that uh, the other uh, DNS record of my domain dev5.dev and I have very basic DNS records. I have a record that points to my server IP and I have two CNAME records. So currently email is not working for my domain because I do not have any MS record or, uh, or uh, TXT record required for proper functioning of email. So let us see how we can configure an external email hosting with our WordPress site. There are several uh, uh, email hosting provider and in this tutorial I am going to use this mxlot.com. You can visit mxlot.com and purchase any email hosting plan. There are three plans, a small, medium, large starting dollar 49 per year. But I guess you might be able to grab at a lesser price under some promo okay so after you purchase any plan from mxlot.com they will send you account details and some dns settings required for the for your domains so these are the dns settings that they have sent me and these are the server address imap and smtp server address these are the port number now let us and this is the control panel that they have provided me so first step we need to do is login into mx cloud control panel and add our domain name so navigate to account manager domain setup and click here add new and here enter your domain name and click create but i have already completed this step you can see my domain name dev5.dev so after adding the domain name, the next step we need to do is we need to create an email account. So navigate to email manager here and then click email accounts. Then from the drop down list, make sure you have selected your domain name, dev5.dev and then click create account. And here enter your username, let me say uh, admin. Okay, admin at the rate dev 5 for dev and generate a password and click create account. Okay, after creating email account, you will receive email account details. So just copy this. I'm going to copy it here. So this is your username, this is your password, and this is IMAP and IMAP server address and this is your SMTP server address. Okay, so we have added our domain name, we have created an email account, but currently email will not work. Why? Because we haven't added required DNS record. So let us now add DNS records required for proper functioning of email. So in my Cloudflare, I will click add record and first I will add MX record. So first is uh, redbull.mxsorting.net and its priority is 10. So type is MX. Name is simply type at the rate. Then server this, just paste this redbull.mxsorting.net and priority is 10. Okay, I'll click save. Okay, they have given one more MX record, so I'm going to copy the second one, and this one will have priority of 20. So again, click add record, type is MX, name is simply we use at the rate, then main server just paste that one, and priority is 20. Click save. Okay, now we will create this SF record. So 
so type is txt and value is this one so just copy this one click add record type is txt name is at the rate and contain just paste the value and click save okay so we have added these two records now we need to add dkim record for that we need to go back to our MX route account and here navigate to account manager then this dkim key okay so we don't need everything we just we are just uh, we just need this one x dot underscore domain key so click this edit button and here turn name just copy this one copy button. click add record type is text txt name is name paste and value from here just copy and here paste and click save so we have added all the dns required for proper functioning of email so now let us check if uh, uh, email is working or not so we can close this one okay so from here click webmail and then click round cube this will open the and uh, this will open a login page so enter your username and password so my username is admin at the red tf 5 dot tf okay and password is this login after login uh, let me create a mail so click compose and here i will send this to my gmail id so to the subject is test mail on f5 and in the body hello this is our test mail okay now click submit send and message sent successfully now let me check my inbox okay so i've received my this test mail test mail from day five now i'm going to reply this mail received thank you i'm going to send this one i'm going to check my email account and Okay, so I received uh, email from my Gmail account. Okay, thank you. Received, thank you. So our mail or uh, outgoing and incoming is working. So we have properly configured uh, domain and we have successfully created email account. So now we want to use this email account admin at the right day five dot dev in our WordPress site for. Uh, every mail that wordpress will send like password is set uh, any mail any mail that uh, that will send from wordpress okay so for that we need to install a plugin so go to dashboard of your wordpress site and there are many plugins that uh, using that plugin you can use uh, any external smtp email hosting but in this tutorial, I'm going to use a very simple plugin. This is SMT Mailer. So, SMTP Mailer. Okay, so this is a plugin, SMTP Mailer by Na986. You can use any other plugin also. There are several plugins. So, now we are going to install this plugin. So, navigate to plugins, add new and search for this one smtp mailer and as you can see there there are many smtp emails but in this tutorial i'm going to install this plugin smtp mailer so click install then activate then go to settings this smtp mailer settings and here we need to 
uh, provide our details of SMTP email hosting. So our SMTP host is provided when we have created a, our email account. So this is SMTP server address redpool.mxrouting.net. This is in my case. In your case, this may be different. Okay. SMTP authentication true. <coughs> SMTP username will be your email account. So my email account is admin at the rate def5.dev and SMTP password is your email password. So my password is this one. Okay. Type of encryption. We are going to use SSL. SMTP port. This port number is provided by MX routing. MX route, uh, and this is mentioned in your account details mail. Uh, in the same mail that uh, they send after you purchase any plan from them and in my case these are the port details so for smtp with ssl this is 465 so 465 okay from email address i'm going to use this admin at the rate day five dot dev and your name so we can see you simply use admin five okay and then click save changes okay so we have added all the details now we're going to send a test mail so test mail to so i'm going to send a test mail again to my gmail id subject test mail from WordPress. Hello, this is a test mail from the five WordPress site. Okay, now click send mail, and so we will get the log details, and it says that this mail has been sent successfully. I'm going to check my email account in my Gmail and here you can see test mail from WordPress. I have the same email. Hello, this is a test mail from the five WordPress site. So email is also working for our WordPress site. So this is how we can integrate uh, any external or third party SMTP email hosting uh, with our WordPress site. Thank you.